So once again, you got another one screaming like a banshee online, telling men about paying their bills. Let's go ahead and roll. You know what? I don't want another motherfucker to offer to take me out to eat, to take me to the movies, to take me nowhere. Unless y'all f- asking me, can y'all pay my motherfucking bills? Straight up. You want me to give you my time? You want me to come through kill? You want me to get my motherfucking hair done, my makeup done and everything else, just to come out and go on a motherfucking date and we ain't talking about no bills. Real men get time from me. Real men get the f- with me. Cause real men pay bills. You little motherfucking boys wanna take a b- out to eat, take a b- to the movies. I don't wanna do that. The only thing I want from a n- is my bills paid. Straight up. We can't do nothing else but that. If you don't remember anything I ever told you, remember this. If a woman starts off telling you about paying her bills, you don't know her. First and foremost, she broke. You don't want a broke woman. Just like a woman don't want a broke man, you don't want a broke woman. Because this woman is broke financially and broken mentally. Because for a woman to be talking to some strange man about paying her bills that she don't even know, she has no kind of common sense. Why would you put yourself even in a position like that? Another thing, fellas, going into 2024, you need to be anti-witchcraft. Now, what I mean by anti-witchcraft, all that mess on her face, it's witchcraft because witchcraft is used to deceive people. You understand? And she is deceiving you how she looks. How do we knew that she was not born a he? You understand? You don't know. See, this is the thing. It's gotten so bad with the witchcraft that you have the trans woman and the biological woman wearing the same makeup, the same lashes, the same uh, wigs, the same everything. So you cannot even really tell a difference these days the way it is with the biological woman and the trans woman. One thing that the trans woman is going to do is make sure that the makeup or the witchcraft is, is very, very out there, right? So as a man, you need to say this. Women who wear that kind of makeup, like you saw in that video, is disqualified, completely disqualified from you talking to them, from you hollering at them. Look, I want y'all to notice something. You guys that travel overseas, and you've seen it, when you get outside the Western world, the women don't wear makeup like that. Think about it. No matter if you go to the Latin America, the Caribbean, where it depends, you got to be careful in some places. But for the most part, outside the Western world, the Caribbean too, the African continent, you know, the Asian world, you don't really see that kind of makeup as the norm. Not saying people don't do it there, but not as the norm. You understand? It's still more of a natural look. Or if you're wearing makeup, it complements you. You still look like yourself. You don't look like one person today and then you take all that mess off. And then that's the thing. You don't want them to have all that witchcraft on their face because then they wipe all that foundation off. And then what if their skin looks so jacked up? It's like, Oh my God, what is up with your skin? Because they chose not to take care of it because they're not working with their dermatologist. They're not eating the right way. They're not drinking enough water as they should. Cause some, listen, if you don't see a woman drinking water at all, so, something going on. What you mean you don't drink water? I don't like water. What? Our bodies need water. What do you mean you don't like water? Every time I look up, you're drinking a freaking uh, liquid diabetes. That that freaking uh, Coke or all that. That's liquid diabetes. You drink that mess every day, it's guaranteed to make you gain weight. Guaranteed. Like, no, you need to actually go drink you some doggone water. Think about your health. All that sugar and all that, that and not even real sugar, high fructose corn syrup, fake sugar at that. What tan, tan your skin up. Men, you, you gotta, you, you gotta, uh, 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 take that stance because look, if you look more about the natural mate, the natural look, you're going to lessen your chances, lessen your chances of encountering a trans woman. Cause you, you, I'm talking about you straight. Men, you don't want to deal with trans women. So if she's wearing no makeup, even better. You see her 
or whatever without it. That way if she put it on, you know how she look. And she'll have to put on that, like, you know, cake in that mess on a no, 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 no. You know, there was one point in time, I seen one sister make a video. She was right. She said all a woman would do is just kind of do their mascara, you know, the eyelashes. They just put some lotion on their face and wear lip gloss, like the different flavored lip gloss. That's all they would wear. And it, she's right. That, that look, I remember that look. I sure do. And it still had a natural look. It didn't look like he was all made up or anything. They'll, like she said, they'll focus more on their outfit than doing all that mess. Of course, do they have, but that's how they were looking. And they didn't have, they, if you notice, especially people like in my age group or maybe a little younger, you notice the, the ladies didn't have all these, these skin problems like you see today when they wouldn't wear all that mess. That makeup messes y'all skin up. All that foundation you're putting on your face is full of chemicals. You don't need all that, especially if you are black. You don't need all that. You you need anything, get out in the sun and get you some good vitamin D. Shoot, uh, Latinas, they don't need it either. I see they take a lot of them don't wear makeup on a good day, right? They don't need it. You see, uh, a lot, a lot of especially the darker Asians, they don't need it. I ain't talking about the white looking ones. I'm talking about the darker ones. They don't need it. So going into 2024, men, the natural look you got to sit up there and prioritize a natural look, natural hair. When you see a sister that got some natural hair, say, Hey, sister, I like your hair. It looks nice. Trust me, that short little line. Now, say you're interested or nothing. You just say it looks nice. Give them the compliment. That literally encourages them to keep doing it when a brother gives them a, a, a say the hair look nice. Believe it or not. I've heard them say it time and time again. Yeah, when a brother say that, it encouraged me to wear it even more. If you trust me, them wigs and all that mess, all them wigs, that's what trans women wear. So you want to get them further and further away from all the fakery, right? And it's going to take you men to do it. Now, if you checked out the process and you say, ah, I'm done with it, they can do whatever they want to do, then I'm not talking to you. But some of the men that's still trying to hopefully find somebody here, you got to push that kind of movement, the natural movement, natural. We're not saying natural as in don't wear deodorant or lotion or nothing like that, but natural as in what that sister talked about. You just put some lotion on your face, some lip gloss, and some mascara, and you get your hair done, and, 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 you, and your outfit look good. You you don't have to do much for yourself, right? But them saying about paying bills, that's a broke woman. That's broke, and she got that prostitute mentality I told y'all about. Transaction of prostitution. No. Take your broke self somewhere else. Let, let some other simp pay your bills. Because no real man will come in there and just open his wallet to some woman he don't know. Loud mouth talking about some bills. Or the same thing. I don't go to this particular restaurant. Okay, don't worry about it. You won't go to nothing at all with me. Don't worry about it. You know what I'm saying? Because one thing I do know, and fellas, you need to keep this in mind. What one lady won't do, trust me, another one.